All right, so with the release of Arc 3.0 and Hunters getting Blink, I'd like to make a tutorial on how to properly Blink and the three different types of Blinks that you will see, okay? So Blink, blink works similar to Burst Glide, where when you jump at a certain time, it's going to activate a different kind of movement. So if I Burst Glide immediately, I'd go up. If I waited to do my Burst Glide, I'd just go forward. And if I wait even longer, I'll just go down, just like that. So swapping the blink here on the Warlock, not using the Ash to Sight Burst, because that does affect blink, but not much, it's just distance. So you'll see if I do it immediately, I go up. I'll go ahead and wait. I'll go forward. I wait even more. Oh wait, I need to recharge it. I'm just going to the ground, okay? So, an upward blink, this is for just height, you just blink immediately. That's at almost the peak of your jump. Okay, once you hit the top of your jump, you can get a forward blink just like that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and toss on Astrocyte so I can have quicker blinks. Okay, so same thing applies, height, distance, and then if you just want to purely go down, you wait until you're at the bottom of your jump and going down. And this is how you're going to be blinking on the hunter as well. So, in PvP, say you wanted to go around a corner and shotgun somebody, and you wanted to be out of their line of sight, you blink up in the air, like this, or something. Or, if you wanted to close the distance between someone, you'd go ahead and do a blink closer to that, and get distance to go catch up to the opponent. Or say you're already in the air, you need to hit cover or something, you could go and blink straight to the ground. That's how you know the three different types of blinks. The main reason why I wanted to make this video was because everyone complains about warlock jumps and oh, I can't do jumping puzzles on warlocks and blah 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 blah. But it also educates you on how a burst glide works as well. So you know how to use them during jumping puzzles. For example, like if I was doing the Vow of the Disciple jumping puzzle and I needed to get height, I'd go instantly, or if I'm trying to cross a gap, I'd wait and do it. This is all the different types of blinking methods and how to blink properly. With Arc 3.0 coming out, this will be useful information for people. Thank you.